Have you ever dreamed about meeting one of the sexiest singers on the planet? Then join us as Es Musica and AT&T make one woman's wildest fantasy a life-changing reality. Thank you, Es Musica. Thank you, AT&T, for Woo! making my dream come true. Maria Green from Boulder, Colorado, won out over a sea of superfans for a trip to Hollywood to meet the man that makes her melt. The Prince of Romance, Enrique Iglesias, at his one and only concert in the U.S. this year. But little did she know, the journey would inspire her to kickstart a whole new life. I've had really tough two years. I got married. The marriage is not going that great. I feel like I've been missing passion and romance in my life. And it's been a struggle for me. Suddenly I hear my cell phone ringing. So I picked it up. I just want a trip to see Enrique and I'm gonna meet him in person. My friend Erin was the lucky one that got to go with me. She said, sure, I'll be with you in the blink of an eye. I've been a fan of Enrique Iglesias since the beginning of his career. He's so handsome, so hot. And that voice is so sexy. Have a great time with Enrique Iglesias concert. Thank you. Somebody needs you. Oh, oh my god, oh my god! Every single night. My muscles are like <laughs> tense. Enrique! All I need is a rhythm divine. Love his music because you feel like dancing, you feel sensual, you feel passionate, it gives you energy, it makes you feel good. I am still in awe. When I meet Enrique Iglesias, I want to tell him how much his music means to me, how low I felt and how unloved I felt, and suddenly he made sense to me. Hola. Hola. Oh my God. Hola. Hello. How are you doing? ¿Qué tal? ¿Cómo te llamas? Maria. Maria. Oh, Maria. Maria de la Soledad. The first time that I saw Enrique Iglesias, I felt just butterflies in my stomach. So excited. Oh my God. I can't believe this. My biggest fear is that I'll be numbed and won't be able to say exactly how much this means to me. Say whatever you want to say. <laughs> I'm you... just so excited. I loved it. And you have, you have a... a... Es un dragón. Un dragón, yeah. ¿Alguna vez has visto un dragón? No. <laughs> it just felt unreal. I mean, I, I, I felt like floating, like I wasn't. I'm in a dream. It was so phenomenal. I believe I'm going to be more positive. I'm going to be happier, and I definitely feel special. My life has changed after this, and I'm going home with a better attitude and. Feeling happy and satisfied. My life has a new beginning. Somebody wants 